Hello and welcome for gamers. My name is Borak and this is another episode of Seven Days to Die, where we try to survive in this hostile environment post in post-apocalyptic world. So in the previous episode, we've managed to find ourselves a home, a bakery. I can smell all those donuts and buns and bread and stuff like that. That is or was was done earlier. As you can hear, we have a spider inside our base. So yeah, those spy those zombies managed to get inside uh, during the night time, but it is not that big of a deal. Okay, I will take those and take it to the to the trader, and I will try to trade that as well. And let's take some money because in today's episode, what I'm going to be doing. I would like to get my hands on the blunderbuss. I would like to make blunderbuss for myself, for myself, and and maybe uh, work uh, towards uh, making myself uh, making myself a uh, bicycle, basically. Right. So let me just take some iron with me. Let me just take some iron with me because I think I might be wrong, but I think I had. I had uh, what do you call it? Forge working at the uh, trader over there, right? I don't know if that thing will work, but I don't care. I will still use it. I will still utilize such thing. Oh no 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 no! no. That spider is creeping me out. Right, and let's hope that I won't sprain my ankle. It's all good. So what I need to do in today's episode, I need to sell some stuff. I need to get some murky water. I need to get me some bones because for the blunderbuss, I will need two pieces of glue. I will need two raw, not raw. I need two pipes and uh, and some wood. Uh, I've used all my wood on a lip around the bakery. So I don't know if it's going to be a okay. Where was that? Oh, shoot. I never marked where the trader was. But I think I came from the direction and it was roughly... Yeah. I think it's a trader. It's over there. So let's head there and let's see if I can make some money. On the money. And if I maybe can get some sort of a mission. I will try to to uh, gather some resources, kill some, kill some zombies in today's episode. And yeah, we shall see overall how it's gonna go. So, I've also spent my points on uh, extending my backpack, basically. So I can carry more stuff while I'm looting. And maybe for once I will hit that goddamn zombie. That's why I need Blunderbuss, because it has a spread like granny's ass. Bam, there you go. Can I borrow, borrow your hand hat? Unfortunately, he's not too much of a talkative guy. Right. Let's go to the trader and let's see what we can find there. And then I need to gather some resources, such as wood as well. Because I spent all my wood on those wooden frames and I don't have any whatsoever. And then most probably I would have to get some some more stuff going on as well and of course we will be looting in today's episode so yeah we should see how it's gonna go the question is if the ford over there at the trader is open for me is it a fatso yes it is hello mr fatso and there are some bones that i could get because i need seven pieces of bones if I would like to make myself a glue over campfire. You're not popping, right? It's your policeman cousin that is doing all that jazz. Oh, come on. How come I cannot hit a guy that is fat as a wardrobe? Come on. Two out of two? I really do have a poor aim. But that one should give you plenty of experience. Yeah, almost twice as much. But I've spent more than... 
more than twice of materials on him. Right. Another playground. So let's see what we can find over here. And thank you guys for the awesome support that you still gave to the series, that you still gave to my channel. It really does mean a lot to me. Oh, look at that. There are potato plants and mushrooms. Nice source of food, especially that. Well, food nowadays is a bit scarce. Maybe not that bad, but in my opinion, you have to spend quite a lot of time gathering those resources and they can be uh, food and water are used very very fast now the question is for a bike i need to have two wheels which is kind of obvious i remember in the past that i was able to get wheels by smacking those wheels that are on uh, on road so the question to you guys is can i still get those wheels or do i have to build them by myself by myself if you could answer to that question in the comment section down below, that would be perfect. Whoopsie, I was teleported to the wrong neighborhood because I honestly don't want to be in here. But while we're here, we might as well check out those cars. I can hear some strange noises. I don't know if you do. Oh, I have found a pipe. Great. I need now I need second. Another one. I have found lockpicks. Stay down. I said, stay the hell down, thank you. There are additional two zombies over there. So when that guy is opening. Please don't blow up that vehicle. No. Oh, fuck. Okay. There was bones over there. God damn it, what a twat. Fortunately, I did not get closer. Because I knew that that would happen. But, oh, second part. That's great. So I don't have to worry about forges anymore. Uh, but say I want to go there to check it out if I do have a, a forge at my availability or not. Right, I'm going to smack all those wheels around here to see if I can get something. And while we're here, I think we can go inside. Just for the sake of going inside. It's not the best POI because it does have... It does have... Ground floor. Okay, yeah, I'll be there with you in just a sec. So we have... Top floors at bottom. Ooh, that's a nice find. And another pipe and a glue. In no time, I will have that blunderbuss going. Cloth. That's nice. Okay, let me just try with another tire. No, still plastics. Okay, if I wear this, okay, I'm gonna be wearing helmet. Now, sham sandwich. Bye bye. Rotting flesh, I don't need it right now. Let trophy, bye bye. You know what? Actually, I could take all of those things and just put them somewhere in here. Office chair. You know, one of the garbage piles i don't know maybe oh i still have to go there to sell all that crap to, to the trader but rotting flesh i don't think so 
Right, okay, let's go upstairs and let's see if there's going to be something of an interest in here, at least in the top section. I don't recall anything up here. Nobody is following me, so that's good. Just uh, remove the glass so I don't make any noises going inside. Somewhere over here there is somebody who is very eager to meet me. But I think it's just downstairs. What the hell was that? Mushroom spores, okay. Oh shit. Oh man, those guys. And one more. Baba. Uh oh. Um. Shit. Okay. Oh shit, 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 shit. He's a fast one. His friend as well. Where did that, did, did the other one go? Oh fuck. Is he dead? Yes, he is. Great. Okay. I just saw the XP that I got. Oh man, that was a close call encounter. Maybe not so close call, but I don't know why I'm panicking so much. As I still have some, as I still have full health, so no biggie. No, oh, there's nothing over here. I was hoping to find something useful or hidden. That just the staircase. Okay, fair enough. Let's go downstairs. And let's, I guess, go to the basement while we're here already. I don't know why I want to do that. Just for funsies, I guess. Funsies and loot, of course. Right, sorry about the darkness, but all to all, I don't think it is that dark nowadays in seven days a day. I was really amazed about the night that it was so bright and everything was so lit. Okay, there was no blizzard, no rain whatsoever, but still, you know, I was expecting it to be more darker at night. I remember that there was a backpack somewhere over in here, in the past. Ooh, I have found some second level tools. Let's now just see if there's going to be another cardboard box over there. Yes, there is. And more loot for me to gather. Right, I'm not going to be going over there because I can't get there from the other side, from the other building. But I think it is time for me to go to the trailer because I am way encumbered. Way too much. That's the other building that I was talking about. I don't think that there's anything special over there. Honestly. Right, being so heavy with all that jazz that I carry right now does not ease. Oh, shoot. That's way too close to the trader. 
but at least I can try again with the tire. No. And all of you are laughing at me. No, Borek, you cannot gather those tires. You have to make them by them by yourself. So you have to gather acid and stuff and blah 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 and so on and so forth. Yeah, I know it. I get it. Sure, why not? Oh, okay. So can I repair it? To be second level, yes, I can. That's nice. So I don't have to spend at least for now points on that. So if I don't have to, I won't do it. Right, that one can be scrapped. This one I can put in here, that one as well. I could repair them both. Now, as for the glass, I really don't need it. This one can be turned into those things. Mushroom spores, yeah, they can stay, die. Why would I need die? And basically, by the looks of it, What am I missing? Oh, one short pipe. Okay. Fair enough. Right, so let's go to the trader and let's, um, let's sell some stuff. Why there's a face of that guy over there? Does he want to speak with me? <coughs> yeah, sure. That explains a lot. Now, I want to sell him the wire tool because I have found plenty till today. Uh, ammunition I will keep with me. All those things I will turn into Duke's coins. Now, lead trophy, lead trophy as far as I remember, I can sell. Um, the same goes with the brass thingy jig. Now, that's an empty water jar. I don't need it right now. Sewing so kit. Stop. Stop bleeding? Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, that makes kind of a sense. But all to all, I need a pipe. Now, that's a lead. I can sell, some, sell him some lead. Uh, nine millimeter ammunition. I'm not the biggest fan of that type of gun. Cha -ching! And, Thanks, yeah, buddy. yeah, yeah, cha ching. I wanted to check double barrel shotgun level one. 400 coins. Ooh, I am short. Not anymore. Aha, I have bought myself a shotgun, baby. And I have some shots. Oh, you want to get huh? Well, maybe you should try Shamway. <laughs> yeah. Right, so I got myself first shotgun. Awesome. Now, gunpowder scope, back shots. Uh, I'm not <laughs> near. I'm not even near to make those uh, shotgun shells, so I'm not gonna be even trying. But do you sell pipes? I could use one pipe, and with that, I would be able to. Ooh, ooh, fu -fu 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 -fu. nine oil. I don't need oil, but I need one pipe, and with that one pipe, I will oh, be able to make myself brander pass. Yes, baby. And I have some ammunition, so in total, I will have two shotguns. Of course, in a way. Right. Do you have any jobs? Fetch, fetch, fetch. Buried supplies. Clear zombies. Hmm. Let's make a pact. You do something for I'd say it's been an honor to work with you. But it would be a lie. I'm gonna go there and get those supplies for him. But first, plunder boss. Let's reload. I have plenty of ammunition. And that is some sort of a shotgun for me. So yeah, hell yeah, baby. We're gonna be using that one. Oh. That one is still in range. So let's get the 400 meters. That's still far away. I don't know if I won't have to leave some stuff. Ooh, there's a workbench in here. I wonder if it's operational. Untouched. Mm, destroyed. Right, completely forgot to check the the, the, the the fort, but that's okay. I shall return soon to the trader. So then I will know. Lead weights. Who goes fishing nowadays? 
Nah. More plastics. Tree stump? Why there is a tree stump over here? Okay. Spend a lot of time destroying that one. But it did not give me anything whatsoever in terms of loot or coolness or whatever you want to call it. What's with this strange fence over there? No idea. Let's go to the point. To the rally point where we are supposed to fulfill that mission or do the mission. And let's check. These are like public restrooms, I guess. Or toilets or water closets. Why am I actually gathering that, those bones? Since I don't have to make myself glue anymore. Okay, I can just do it because I can do it. But I don't need it anymore. Since I have made myself a land bus and I have my... And I bought myself a shotgun. This is a place where you can find plenty of recipes, at least in the past. What was that? Repair kits. And some painkillers. Nice. Okay, so let's do that. Let's do this. Recipes, torch. Yeah, sure. We can make a torch. Throw away that lead. But let's leave that... Colosseum? Huh? Never been one to one of those. Still, what level am I? That is a question. Have I leveled up? Where's my... Uh, ooh, points available. Four. Well, what level am I, actually? Level two. Okay. So, I can spend some points. So, if you guys could give me a hand and tell me on what? Oh yeah, I know on what. Grease monkey. That's something that's... Grease monkey. That one. But it's over here, so I need to do what? Like that one, and then this one. Okay. So now I can make myself mini bike. Forge also would be nice, but all comes will come over time. No, that's bicycle, not bike. So yeah, I need two wheels and chassis and handlebars, duct tape, leather, short pipe, springs. Now there was a wrench. There still is a wrench and a ratchet and uh, some sort of a power tool that I don't remember the name. Screwdriver, electronic, electric screwdriver, something like that. Another sewing kit. That's nice. Activate rally point. Right, I think we're going to be activating that one in the next episode. Because I think we are running low on time. And yeah, it's been a pleasure. It's been absolute pleasure to play that game again. Search clo clothing pile. Ooh. And another pipe. And don't know what that is. Call it jacket. Nice. So now I look like half of an ass hat. Great. And there is a water in the basement. Right. So yeah, that's going to be it for today's episode, guys and girls. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment over the gameplay, subscribe to the channel if you're new and you like what you see. And I hope that we will see each other in the next episode when we'll continue this awesome adventure with this awesome game. So take it easy, have fun, and happy gaming. Bye-bye.